Welcome back to Every Disney Movie Ever. My name is Justin. I'm watching Every Disney Movie Ever. Today I'm going to talk about Snow Buddies. Snow Buddies is a 2008 directed video release about the buddies finding themselves in Alaska and helping a boy fulfill his dream of having a sled team. It is directed by Robert Vence. Cinematography by Kamal Derekawi. Editing by Kelly Heron, music by Bram Wenger, and it's written by Robert Vince and Anna McRoberts. The film stars Dominic Scott Kay as Adam, Josh Flitter as Butterball, Skyler Gisando as Bee Dog, Henry Hodges as Mud Bud, Liliana Mummy as Rosebud, Jimmy Bennett as Buddha, and Dylan Sprouse as Shasta. You are not ready for what I'm about to share. On the set of this film, an American Humane Society certified representative came out to set. They had 30 puppies, 15 golden puppies were on set, and 15 golden puppies were at the vet being treated for Giardia and um, Cocidia. I don't know how to pronounce it. The representative requested that the other 15 get checked out. 25 were from an American breeder, five were from a Canadian breeder. They discovered that all puppies were eight weeks old or approximately eight weeks old, which means they were transported when they were about six weeks, which was against the law. According to USDA at the time, they could not be transported at all until they were eight weeks or later. Um, so all 30 puppies were removed from the set. They got 28 new puppies who were older and they were brought in. Um, and all 28 <laughs> were exposed to parvovirus and six fell ill um, after exposure. So this film <laughs> was not allowed to use. No animals, no animals were harmed in the making of a movie. And they received an unacceptable rating from the American Humane Association, which is insane, okay? Um, I learned this information, I was so upset. As I'm sure most of you know, I work with puppies and dogs and animals. And uh, this information was very upsetting to me. I hate that they put all of these puppies at risk. Um, I hate that they transported the puppies too early. Uh, I just hate all of that in general. So it really tainted my experience. Mouths. I'm very conflicted for this one because one, knowing the backstory of it, I'm like genuinely upset <laughs> at all the puppy like kind of mistreatment and miscare. Um, so it's hard to like watch and see all these puppies doing all this cute stuff when I'm like, these poor puppies were overworked and exposed to viruses. Um, but then on the one side, just looking at the movie as a whole, it's sloppy, but it's not that bad. Like compared to the last one, the first Air Buddies movie, right? It is more cohesive. The Air Buddies movie, I feel like was all over the place. We had a dog napper who wanted, you know, gold. He wanted Air Bud with her his freaking collection or some crap. I don't, it was just a mess, right? This one is a little more cohesive because you have one goal. The kid wants to have a sled dog team. The golden puppies want to get home like cohesive so it's not well done like it is very sloppy and messy but it's a, just a smidgen more cohesive so it just like makes a bit more sense you're able to follow it without being like ah this movie's actual garbage i hate it you're just more like yeah it's not the best movie but like all right i'm along for the ride i suppose there is a little bit too much like they train with talon and you know, Buddy and Molly are looking for them. And I'm still not over how old Buddy would have to be in this universe at this point. Like it's ridiculous. Shasta lost both parents. So you got that going on. Adam's going against his dad's wishes by doing a sled dog team. It's just like a lot. My favorite scene, which I guess I'll, I'm spoiling, um, was between Rosebud and B-Dog. They actually had a quiet moment where B-Dog was like, I'm scared. And Rosebud was like, it's okay to be scared. I thought that was a very touching scene hidden in this movie. I feel like these have been really shallow. And I thought that was like a pretty deep scene for how shallow these movies have gotten. So I really enjoyed that. Yo, this cast is stacked, okay? You got people from Mad TV. You got Dylan Sprouse, you got Dylan Minnette, super young. Holy heck, you got Jim Belushi. 
as the St. Bernard. You got Whoopi Goldberg as the walk-on, walk-off cat. Like, I can't believe how many people they had in this movie. Like, <laughs> that either went on to become very big stars or were already big stars that came in and did like two days of dialogue and left. Like, I can't believe that is so insane to me. Favorite part I already mentioned was the scene between Rosebud and B-Dog. I think it's the most touching part of the movie. Period. Least favorite part? The freaking uh, musher guy letting his dog start to drown and get hypothermia before Adam saves them? Absolutely not. I didn't like watching that. I genuinely was like, are these huskies okay? Are they actually in cold water? Which like I doubt. But they look so scared and sad to be in the water and I hated it. Recommend? No. Watch again? Absolutely not. I'm not supporting this movie after this stuff has happened. Specific moments. Um, the Northern Lights were pretty. Talon was really random. Oh, that actor. I forgot his name. That was another big guy being in this movie. Um, I hate this because of the background info of what happened with all the puppies. Um, the puppies being like tossed around in that metal container of ice cream, they would have died. There's no way, especially with all that ice cream jostling around. Um, and then Bernie, the St. Bernard, real original name, Jim Belushi, um, was giving Barry the great St. Bernard, the movie <laughs> that I have watched. Um, and I loved that. He was like saving everybody in the snow. And I was like, yes, you're adorable. And I love you, do your job. Um, and I loved that. That's everything I have for snow buddies. Um, my final rating is three. Husky puppies out of 10. My total movie, or my, our total movie count is. <laughs> Parent, that's all is. <laughs> Cry count is still the same. If you want to keep up with the movie I'm watching when, follow me on all socials. You'll find out what movie I'm watching when. Join Patreon. Got a tier starting at just $1. Every, every video a week early. Coupon code for merch, exclusive merch, etc. This month, it is all video trivia. And I work so hard on it. So please join the $5 tier and participate in trivia, okay? Buy merch. Merch is great. Merch is grand classic this is my first one so it's peeling or like because i've had it for years at this point uh, until next time comment subscribe but i'm not in charge of your life you are so do you and don't be the musher guy that let his dog start to drown that guy sucked hello romeo ring 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 banana phone